Like you're gonna be off the ground in a minute, seriously. Yeah. And you're, you're, you're officially off the ground. What? Yeah. There's not much weight on your back end. Hey. How's that? You're nearly off the ground. Ever since I watched this movie called The Gods Must Be Crazy, and they winch this Land Rover, this old Land Rover, I think they, they flick the switch or something accidentally, and this Land Rover ends up getting winched all the way up a tree. Ever since I seen that, I always thought, I want to have a crack at winching a four-wheel drive up a tree. <laughs> I've got half an idea what you're thinking. What? You want to go up? <laughs> <laughs> All the way up. Yep. What do you reckon, Jake? It'll test it. It will. Oh, it'll test everything. It's going to test the, the rope, it's going to test the hook, it's going to test the mounting position. It's going to test everything. the tree. It'll test the tree, <laughs> test the luck, test Swampy. Who's putting the rope up there? That's Simon's job. Go for a climb? Oh, yeah. First, I go to climb up the tree and there's a vine there, so I climb up and then little smart Alec Pants has already bloody planned it and he's got a ladder already you stashed down the back. He must have been planning it for days. He scarpers up, up his little ladder. Yeah, you got a ladder on. <laughs> Looks like hard work getting up there like that. I'm up. Look, all jokes aside, look, realistically, all jokes, you know, we'll stop being funny for a second here because it is a little bit silly. We had to make sure it was connected to the tree properly. It's an awesome branch to go around. It's tough as. You're doing it the hard way, mate. Yeah, but if we're out in the bush and we had to get up a tree, we wouldn't have a ladder, see? Yeah, I generally don't winch my truck up a tree out in the bush. You never know, you might have to. And we realised that the tree was going to take the load and you put the, the strap in the right place so it wouldn't move. That one? Threw into here like that. Yeah. All right, Jake, send up the winch. Connect it up with all the right bits of equipment, you know, the, the eight tonne, you know, tree protector and the, and the six ton bow shackle and all that sort of stuff. We knew everything was, was strong enough to take the load. It was just down to the winch, whether the winch was going to lift it up the tree and whether or not the mounting points were strong enough. All right, is she secure? I reckon so. All right, coming down. Coming down. Is it all right if I use your ladder? Yeah, you can use my ladder. Thanks, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you don't care if you break it, do you? Because I'll be the one fixing it. <laughs> oh, you're a clever lad, Jake. You're pretty clever. <laughs> what do you reckon, mate? Looks secure? Well, you've been driving the Lux, mate, so she's your job. My job. Oh. You I'm get to go up, up in the oh, world. Oh, Jake's going up the tree. He's going up in the world. I wasn't too surprised when Simon offloaded the driver's seat to me to go up the tree. If they do get off the ground, I can see him getting stuck oh, yeah. ass first in the ground. We'll see if they get off the ground first. All right, mate, fire up. Hey, guys, today's video is brought to you by the new product from Camp Boss 4x4. Now, it's called the Nudie Boss Shower Tent, and it's designed to be convenient and easy to pack up and set up and have a private area where you can get dressed, changed, have a shower, go to the toilet, whatever you want to do. It's awesome. It's easy. Check this out. How cool is that? Simple as that, guys. <laughs> so inside, if you have a quick look, you'll notice there is, there's a couple of uh, pouches here to store some stuff, your shower gel or whatever. Up here, have a look at this. So that's where the shower head will come through. Comes with a light. Have a look here. So the switching of the light, we've got white and orange. And this is pretty cool as well. I can put the roof in. A couple of Velcro clips and I've got a private place where I can either go to the toilet, I can do have a shower, all those sorts of things. There she is, guys, the nudie boss. Now, if you get a chance, go on to Camp Boss 4x4 shop online or check out your local Camp Boss 4x4 dealer. Anyway, back to the adventure. Keep that engine running, sticker in neutral. Good to go. Put off the brake. I think they might get hooked up on them branches too. And away we go. It's gonna take a while. Anyway, so me and Jake are in the uh, swampy. I'm glad I'm not in there. And uh, I've got the winch remote, and away we go. Wow. And sure enough, it starts winching, and it did exactly what I thought it would do, just drag us towards the tree, and then just start lifting the front of the, the swampy. 
How's it look? Hey, you're all good on the front. Yeah. Front's all good. Not moving? No. Nah. The gold bar's not falling off. Not touching yet? Not yet. You're about to. Yeah. Let's go. Wow. That's some serious grunt. And up she goes. We're going now. You are, indeed. We're on the tree now. You know, I live and breathe that sort of stuff, but it was certainly a different feeling hanging up in a tree, not knowing which way you were going to sway if you might barrel roll around the corner there. You might be able to drive up the branches, drive up the tree. So it's like on a roller coaster ride and you're sort of going up and up and up and up and you're sitting back in your seat. Mate, you're going to be off the ground in a minute, seriously. Yeah. And you're, you're, you're officially off the ground. What? Yeah. There's not much weight on your back end. Please. How's that? You're nearly off the ground. Keep going. Keep going. Oy. We have the tree. You have the tree, dude. Spin this wheel a bit. Spin the wheel? As in drive? Uh, try and turn that way. Turn that way? You like to drive. Is it jamming up on the branch? Yeah, you jammed on the ground. Yeah, we jammed on yeah, the ground. You're off the ground. Oh, go back there, but you're off the ground then. Can you hold it there? Yeah. Hold it there. What are you doing? You're officially totally off the ground. <laughs> you're kidding me. No. Look. <laughs> we made it. She'll do it. Holy ah, crap. Let's go. It's holding. The whole rig is being held by the winch rope and the winch mounts. So once, once we're sort of up the tree, as far as we can go, it's now like, all right, well, let's go backwards. You're, you're trying to let the winch out. We'll see if we can get it down now. Don't like it up here. The winch is working just as hard coming down as it was going up. No, we're stuck. You're stuck. <laughs> you're stuck on the street, dude. <laughs> is, it, is the rear bar? Yeah, the rear bar's very Is it dug in? Are we stuck? Yeah. Oh, you better get us out. I'll have to go get a tractor and pull you back. You better get the tractor. Hurry up, eh? If the tow bar wasn't hooked in the ground, I think it would have rolled around the tree and actually ended up on its side. I had my fingers crossed that was going to happen. It would have been pretty funny. <laughs> and now that's jammed in the dirt, well, we're sort of a bit stuck. What? Checking the motor's OK, run it on that angle. Oh, OK. Just switch her off for a second. It nearly went to plan. We did get stuck up there. The tow bar uh, got stuck in the ground on the way back down, and old Simon there had to run up and get the tractor, bring it back down, and, and pull us backwards, basically, just to get us unstuck. Time to go Ooh. steady. Holy. Oh. Well, that worked. Crazy. Can you hear me? Go backwards. Straighten your wheels up. Straighten her up. Straighten your wheels. This way. This way. Stop. Woo. We made it. <laughs> <laughs> i tell you what. Mate, that's seriously test swampy. Yep. And the winches. And the winches, for sure. Yep. Yeah, I'm going to get out of there. I'll tell you now. Very glad to get out of there. Oh, that's one hell of a ride up a tree. Mate, I'm impressed. I'm so impressed with these winches. They're tough and they're going to do the job. They'll be fine. I don't have to fix anything. You doing good, Jake? No, she's all good, mate. Beauty. This is tough, eh? Job done. Put it there, bro. Tested. Good job. Definitely tested. Good job. Done deal. Good, good job, job, mate. Good job. We've done it. Yeah, so my job here, fixing and modifying things, is done. and. Now they can go away and create some more carnage for me. I reckon she's ready to go out in the bush. No doubt. All right, let's get it. Let's get it ready, load it up, and get the hell out of here. Ooh, yeah. Introducing the home of Australian adventure, Unleashed TV. A growing library of content featuring the best of four-wheel driving, <laughs> fishing, touring, 
rebuilt. Bush cooking and whatever you call this. Hope the airbags take up. Stream entire seasons of the hit TV show All for Adventure. Get me out of here, boys. Water's coming in. Unleashed. Oh, that's tight. And more original series from Jace and the team. In this mini-series, we're going to be exploring some of the most remote coastlines. Plus, get fresh new content exclusive to Unleashed TV subscribers. Mathis, mate, this is all going on down here. You can stream it all for just $9.99 per month. Yeah! That's why Unleashed TV oh, yeah. is the home of Australian adventure. Not washing it. He got it. He smoked it. Oh yeah!